What is the future of Call of Duty? Find out next! What is up guys, it is your boy El Cholo and today's video we're going to be talking about Infinite Warfare. Saying I'm just joking with you guys. Today we're going to be talking about the future of Call of Duty, the franchise, alright, the most popular first person shooter ever. Literally, like, it is ever, right? I mean, right now it's not very popular, you know. Uh, CSGO and all these League of Legends nerds are taking over Call of Duty. If you go to Twitch, I cannot even find uh, Call of Duty players like Scumpy, you know, you know, professional nerds that play this game all all day. That play, you know, you already know how it is. I don't see them live streaming like they used to, you know, back in Black Ops 2, uh, Black Ops 3, I will say, you know. You know, I don't watch Call of Duty competitive anymore like I used to. Uh, last time I watched was Black Ops 3 a little bit, but Advanced Warfare, I like, I watch everything. But I think I'm getting off topic right now, so let's just get into the video. Come on. Come on. Bring it on. <clears throat> All right, so the future of Call of Duty. Very simple. This year, we're going to be getting World War II. We know that for a fact. It is releasing on November 3rd of this year. But guess what? Time is just going to fly so fast, guys. Like, literally. Like, we are halfway through the release of this new game. And I feel like Infinite Warfare just came out. And and, all, and also, I feel like this Infinite Warfare, it never came out. Like, it's so ass. I'm not even joking. It's so ass. It's just crazy. Compared to Black Ops 3, it's Infinite Warfare is so ass. I just can I just can't. I just cannot play this game. <laughs> so many things in that game, bro. All right. So that's Infinity War. Uh, next year, it's Treyarch's turn to make a Call of Duty. And we know for a fact that the next three Call of Duties are going to be boots in, boots in the ground. And that is including World War II. So World War II is boots in the ground. Treyarch's next Call of Duty, it is going to be boots in the ground that's for a fact because the founder of activision the ceo right that is of activision right now literally said that the next three call of duties will be in the past and will be not in the past but boots in the ground so that means classic movement no advanced movement all right so that is great so that confirms that uh treyarch's next call of duty will be boots in the ground but we don't know what type of Call of Duty. We don't know what era because we know that Black Ops 4 will not be happening. All right. It will not happen. You know, if if Black Ops 4 happens, then they will have to go to the future. Right. Because, you know, Black Ops 3 is in the future. Black Ops 4 will be even more futuristic than Infinite Warfare, I will say. But that's not going to happen because literally the next three Call of Duties will be in the modern and past call of duties you know because you already know the futuristic theme is not going to work and activision knows that so no more futuristic call of duties that's for a fact no more of that junk we're gonna be getting some classic boots in the ground modern call of duties in the next few years and some old classic call of duties like the one we are getting this year so what what do I think Treyarch is going to do? Um, well, they are finishing Black Ops Three. I mean, Black Ops Three is over. They're not working on Black Ops Four. That's for sure. Um, <coughs> what could they be working on? World at War Two? Hell no! That's not happening. This year we're getting World War Two, and you really think that we're gonna be getting? A similar very similar game to the one that we the we're getting this year like uh, you know World at War came out in 2008 by Treyarch now we're getting on 2017 a World War 2 which is going to be very similar I will say than the one that came out in 2008 but with better graphics and you already know with all the good stuff and supply jobs and you know and World at War literally was taking place in the World War in the World War Two era too, so it wouldn't really make sense for Treyarch to make 
you know, next year, the Call of Duty, set in the World War II, because it will just be very similar, right? I mean, I don't know. It will just be very similar. And, you know, they want to innovate. They want to give us something fresh, you know. And I don't think that they will just bring us, you know, a World War II Call of Duty. I don't see that happening. So what could they be doing? In my opinion, they are probably working. I mean, these are my predictions. I don't know for a fact. We will know in one year from now, of course. Uh, either uh, before uh, World War II, you know, in the way, way, past, way in the past, or it is more likely that they will make like a modern Call of Duty, you know. Not like Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 was like set in the 2025, right? And Modern Warfare was like set in like in the modern, like we are in the modern era right now. You know, like in the 1990s, 2000s and stuff like that. And when they're going to make a modern Call of Duty, it will be set, you know, during the 70s and 80s, 90s. I will say 80s to to that 2000s you know because black ops 2 was set in the future the 20 2025 that's pretty that's i mean we're not even in 2025 you know the technology is just getting better so you know it's going to be uh before black ops 2 that's that's for sure right we don't want to see no more futuristic call of duty and they know that and they're not making that happen so treyarch is probably working for a modern Call of Duty. Well, what about Infinite War? Oh no, what about Infinite Infinity War? You know, because that's what's gonna come after Treyarch. Infinite War if it was a failure. It didn't work. The sales are so bad. What are they gonna make? You know, what are what game are they going to bring? It's not going to be, of course, in the future. That's for sure. It's not gonna happen in the future. So what are they gonna do? Make another modern Call of Duty or a Modern Warfare 4 Call of Duty or like something different, you know? Or maybe a Call of Duty f way back, you know, like in the B&M era, you know? I, no, no, no way. Uh, World War, after the World War II, I think it's the B&M. Guys, I don't know the history, so what, I don't care. Um, but they, they, I don't know yet. I don't know for Infinite Warfare, but <clears throat> I will predict that they're either going to make a modern Call of Duty or a Call of Duty in the past, way before World War II, you know, or like in World War One. Because if we get two new Call of Duties, you know, back to back in the past, it will just be very similar, you know. So it doesn't make sense for them to, you know, bring two Call of Duties in the next two years set in the World War Two. So they're, they're probably going to, you know, make a... Well, this year, of course, World War II, and the next one will be in the modern called, you know, in the modern era, Treyarch, and Infinity War, they could make, you know, a, a Call of Duty in the past, you know, during the World War II, World War One, or before that, so, you know, so we can get, you know, fresh Call of Duty, a new Call of Duty each year that is fresh and not repetitive, because people get tired with the same team, and that's why, um, they went to the future because you know it was uh, a new team you know the futuristic team we've never seen and it was just fresh but it didn't work the community didn't like it and now we're getting uh, you know a mix a mix of Call of Duties uh, in the past in the modern not the futuristic so I don't know what Infinite, Inf Infinity War will do but I will assume that they will either start with a new series because infinite warfare is over they're, they're probably gonna start with um you know with a modern call of duty like maybe modern warfare 4 but i do not think that they will do that you know or you know or i'm um, or a completely new title i mean that's what they have it's the same thing with Treyarch, a completely new title you know so yeah guys that was it for the video. I mean, it's very simple. Treyarch is going to either make a cut in the past or a modern cut. I I think that they're going to be making a modern, a modern Call of Duty. In Infinity War, 
will either do in the past or in the you know in the modern as well but new titles all right no new series not um not black ops 4 not infinite warfare 2 not call of duty ghost that's not happening so yeah guys that was it for the video i'm pretty excited for call of duty world war 2 I mean, this game looks amazing, and I'm just excited. You know, in time, it's just going to fly, and we're going to just play the game. And, yeah, so in the meantime, I'm going to play Black Ops 3 because it feels kind of like Black Ops 2, and that's what I like. Yeah. So, yeah, guys, that was it, and peace.